Hello, I am Andy Duwada. Today we are reacting on a work night to SCP. Right, this is SCP 420. Oh, yeah. I don't even know what that means. Alex, do you want a fruit shoot? No. What's it called, Jack? Fruit sack? Uh, yes, please. Long so this in. is SCP 420. The, the last Air bar is finally closing condition. down for the night. Or it would. Except that the bartender is having trouble getting rid of a customer. This is at the how long is this? Right. So this only lets me record for five minutes, and there's eighteen minutes. Do the maths. That's four parts. So there will be four parts to this video. I don't know how to compile them. So Bar, an old derelict this is, is part demanding one. yet another drink. The bartender grumbles in annoyance. This derelict is sloppy drunk, and the bartender just wants to go home. Closing time. Dad. Right, this Just guy. More, protests the dare. Dad, he's winking with his. I can't wink with my right eye. I actually took it. Maybe I should drink alcohol. Ehrlich <laughs> shaking his empty glass for emphasis. I've got money. He laughs at his own words. His giggles ending with a loud yeah, belch that blows that's a cloud what, of that's aromatic vapor what I just said. in the bartender's face. That's it. This okay. derelict has been hanging out at yeah, this bar, part causing part trouble part all part night. Part the bartender has had enough. Get out of here says the bartender as he hustles the wobbling derelict out the door. You're done. Oh, the dang. The the oh, he called hot. The are really hitting Savage. It isn't so often that he's Tell got the money to burn, but when he me. does, he likes to spend it here. The prices are right, and the conversation is minimal, which is just the way that he likes it. Dan, you don't the like conversation. Around, fire in his eyes. He's Which. raring to fight, and he doesn't care that the bartender is quite a bit larger than he is. Right now, all he can see is red. Don't tell me why I've had enough, he slurs, raising his fists as he prepares to lash out. But the bartender has already slammed the door in his face. Defeated, the derelict turns his back on the closed bar and starts a slow stumble down the street. Stupid bartender, mutters the derelict, turning up his collar against the cold bite of the night air. He wishes that he just had one more drink to warm his stomach against the chill. He's so out of it that he doesn't stop to think that the bartender did him a favor by refusing to fight. There is no way that the derelict would have won that battle. Even if he was in his physical prime, even if the bartender wasn't twice his size, the derelict is in no shape to fight. His vision is blurry, and his head is swimming. In oh, fact, dang. he can barely remain upright. If he had any sense, he would probably If you had enough home. alcohol, then you can't stand... You can barely stand upright. <laughs> and you try to fight... And sleep this off. But the this night is, is young mad. and he's not ready uh, to give it's, up. It's an SCP. He walks down the street, uh, eyeing reactive. every storefront in hopes of finding yeah. another bar. Unfortunately, every window has a closed <laughs> sign in it. He swears under his breath. What a run of bad luck. Oh, What's a guy damn. supposed to do in this town? Wonders. Just okay. when he's about to give up hope, he spies something glinting in the reflective halo of a street lamp. Oh, he stumbles no, closer please, to get a better look. And he can hardly believe I his bet eyes. You. Finally, Ten pounds, that is changing. the SCP. Someone has abandoned I the half-empty bottle. Well, hello there, little friend, says the derelict. Yeah, the he struggles to focus, but the world is no, spinning. In his confusion, he could swear he's it seen is things. But no, he can feel the haft of the glass bottle in his alert. hand, and he knows that it is as real as he is. Who left you behind? Who would leave a perfectly good bottle just sitting out here? He recognizes this brand. There's only about three fingers of liquid left, but that's better than nothing. Some people might balk at drinking out of a random bottle that you found on the street, but the derelict like doesn't give it a second thought. He tips the bottle back and slurps it all down. It oh burns God. going down, just as it should, he thinks. <laughs> he sighs in contentment as he feels the harsh you liquid warm his stomach. Man. Perfect. That really hit the spot. But what happens next surprises him so much that he can't believe his eyes. There's still liquid in the bottle. Oh, he blinks, the... wondering if maybe his ass brain is playing SCK. tricks on him. But he shakes the bottle cautiously yeah, and is rewarded think, with yeah, a telltale swish of liquid. That's no illusion. He takes another swig, guzzling it down. Normally, he'd drop the bottle to the ground and stumble on, but something makes him pause. He maintains his grip on the bottleneck and raises it again to take another look. And sure enough, there's still more left in the bottle. The derelict cannot believe his luck. He feels like he must have won the lottery. He's found a never-ending bottle. Already his mind is reeling with possibilities. That bartender really thinks he's so smart, he mutters to himself as he weaves unsteadily. I don't need him anymore. See if I ever go to this stupid bar again. He just lost his best customer. Now that I have you, little bottle, 
I don't ever need to pay for drinks ever.